Amid the positive speeches and the protests, most people in Racine County just went about their day as per usual. Yeah, the president being in town caused some headaches with road closures, but overall, those near the Foxconn site are cautiously optimistic. Sean Gallagher has their story. The landscape here in Mount Pleasant is changing quite literally as they do the groundbreaking for the new Foxconn plant. But regardless of party lines or feelings about President Trump, the residents here in this area are hopeful for the future. Gas stations are one of the few truly neutral grounds, but for this quick trip, its location is the epicenter of a political debate with President Trump just down the street for the Foxconn groundbreaking event. Great opportunity for the area. We're going to get stronger. So it is getting people off the couch and, you know, um, trying to get into to the work field. Um, but I don't know about that Donald Trump. The Taiwanese company says the $10 billion plant will bring 13,000 jobs to the area. So politics aside, people at this gas station are seeing eye to eye and being cautiously optimistic. Politics has nothing to do with providing opportunities for everyone. There's risk in anything, but you can't win unless you enter. And you have to try, we have to make things happen. And the old saying, if not now, when? And in a very divisive world, these people can all agree on one thing. They want what's best for people in Wisconsin. Sooner or later, we all have to come together. I don't know how you cannot realize that these are good things for everyone. As long as we aren't selling our souls, as long as we aren't compromising our values as Wisconsinites to bring this company here. And Foxconn says the plant should be fully operational by 2020. In Mount Pleasant for the now, I'm Sean Gallagher.